Belfast bikes. There's over 350 of them throughout the city. Josh Saron is one of the many who use the scheme. What does he think of them? I like using the Belfast bikes because I'm a big advocate for um, uh, sustainability and being carbon neutral. I think it's important that people kind of recognise the problem that, you know, big carbon emissions like cars are having on the environment. And they're good for Belfast because, you know, let's be honest, Belfast isn't the most uh, car friendly city in the world. In fact, Belfast is the sixth worst city in the UK for congestion. But with almost 800 subscriptions to the service in 2019, what do they like to use? The handling's great, steering, stabilisation, all fantastic, yeah. Just like having my own bike. The wheels are really, really good, really stable. The tyres are always pumped up, so they're never flat, which is, you know, great. The handlebars are really good. As a student, I'm really happy with the price and with the, the membership programme and with the, the app. They're really affordable, they're really cheap. Despite these benefits, 25% less bikes were rented out last year compared to 2016. For Josh, the scheme could be improved. Is that they're more centralised in South Belfast and not North and West, um, which is a bit of an issue. But I'd like to see more in North and West Belfast because that's sort of, you know, it has a tendency to be more cars around that area. It's a bigger polluter. But during the summer months, it tends to be a bit difficult to get a hold of these bikes because obviously people are enjoying the weather. They're uh, trying to stay healthy during the summer months. And it's really difficult to kind of get a hold of these bikes because there, there isn't many. Uh, more of these bikes should be available outside of Belfast. I'm, I'm kind of shocked actually that um, they're more the sort of just available in Belfast because you know they should be available in places like Derry, the second largest city. With Northern Ireland's ambitious climate change targets, there are increasing calls for the scheme to be expanded to get people on their bikes. Peter Moore reporting.